Hi guys! Today I'm gonna make a video on my bunny rabbit. His name is Razzy. And I had him for about um, a year now. I adopted him at the shelter. So what I want to say about having a rabbit is that you have to have space for him to kind of interact with you guys. So we just put, um, not a cage, but like kind of like a fence in the living room. So we kind of um, fence off an area of the living room and then we put his food, water, and everything he needs in there. So when at nighttime he goes back to his playpen, I would call it, we kind of just close the doors and he can't really come out of it. And then during the day, we just let him roam around because he is pretty much potty trained. I mean, he definitely is potty trained. Um, he never ever pees anywhere outside of his um, like litter. He has a litter where he pees and poops in there. And during the day, because we always leave his like playpen door open so he would go in there to do his business and come back out to play um the only thing i would say about um having a bunny is that you have to make sure you don't have wires um around the house because he has chewed through um a floor lamp like he chewed the wire because we had the lamp in the corner of the living room and it was plugged to the wall and he just basically chewed the whole wire off so the lamp no longer works and then he chewed through some of my um, phone chargers I believe um, as well as computer cords and like headphone cord like headphone um, things like um. so if you have any wires like laying around the house um, he will chew it because he'll think it's like a toy or something and he'll just chew it through so i mean even if he doesn't chew it through like he just chews a little bit because it's either so sharp you know he could chew like wood and stuff so if he just bite on the wires like he basically just like bite on like my headphone wires and then they just don't work anymore because it's broken inside you know so um that's my advice don't ever leave um wires around the house he'll chew it also um make sure you have time to like interact with him and play with him that's why we leave him in the living room because even if we kind of like lock him up at night sometimes we still watch tv there and he's there so we interact with him if not he'll like kind of look for you and then if you're in a certain room then he'll come like kind of um hang out with you for the most part and then um they like to do this thing called binky when they're happy so if you give them space like if you don't leave them locked up then they'll come out and then they'll like jump around and do this like happy dance called binky and then definitely feed him like hay and water um also make sure you feed him like some fruits and veggies like he likes kale and any sort of green veggies as well as like um, oranges, apples, and we give him like slices of those and stuff as well. But overall, I think Bunny is a very ideal pet. They're very friendly. I mean, if I had him for a while, some people would let me hold him like this. But also, you know, they don't make any noise and they're very like cute, you know, and they'll let you play with them, you know, if you don't get them angry and stuff like that. So I think I'm going to let my bunny go because he's had a long time here and he doesn't like to be held that much. So that's it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll try to answer them. Thanks guys and bye guys. Bye.